All right, for the next one, I'm not gonna respond at all. I'm gonna pretend it does not bother me one bit. I will not be terrified. I'm gonna be stoic as a rock. Emotionless. Zero response. Dead. Who's next? Trying real hard. Did you see that sick micro there? See? Seven Zom knows how to respond, chat. Look, 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 this is look, this is how it's done. You see that? Chat? You see, chat, you see that? Wow. Is only wrote. That's that's all that was needed. See? No kick W's, no L U L's. <sighs> no, not the wow kappa. It's not the same thing. Uh, no, that's not how any of this works. <sighs> Maybe I should sing songs. Maybe that's better. That way nobody will be scared. killed oh wait what oh shit I don't know where to go I thought this was the way I've got wrong the whole time Forward there? New subscriber detected. Thank you very much, Magarathia. Okay, alright, alright. Pretty sure I wouldn't have saved if I didn't make that noise. If I didn't make that noise, pretty sure the save game wouldn't have happened. <laughs> wow. <laughs> See? You're not. Thanks, thanks guys, yes. Much New better. Subscriber detected. Much better. Wow. Wow. I like the way Brian says wow. It's pretty good. Oh shit. <sighs> Thank you, Waffle Shorts. 
Man, I just love horror games. It's my favorite genre. Is there honestly anything? Oh yeah, of course, now there's no power. Is there anything better than, uh... Is there anything better than horror games? I don't think so. Skytles? Honestly, playing against Skytles, horror games, getting over it. Those are some of my favorite things in the whole wide world. Those are a few of my favorite things. Skytles and hammers and getting over it in alien isolation. These are a few of my favorite things. Ba 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 ba. Da ba ba ba. Can we have alien isolation with Bennett? <laughs> with Bennett's narration? That would be great. Is this based on real life events? Yes. How else could they have filmed it? Oh my god, look, it's a NAS. <laughs> this is what my NAS looks like. Perfect. Because David Attenborough could be narrating everything. And over here, we have Loco in his natural habitat. He may, <laughs> he may be perceived as calm right now, but don't let it fool you. Any moment now. Bill was shouting for help, crying like a baby. I'm more of an alpha core kind of guy, if I'm being honest with you. Like, none of this beta core shenanigans. But... Never panic! Always stoic as a rock! Have you ever seen a rock be scared? Didn't think so. Guess why? Because it's a rock. What a dumb question. Rocks are pretty dumb. Ah, to be fair, they've been around for a long time. No, 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 I don't mean... No, not Dwayne. No, no, no. Dwayne seems kind of smart, to be honest. He seems like a nice guy. Loco, stop being strong and masculine. Right, it's a bit toxic of me, but I mean, this is just how it is, guys. Never scared. Never shout. Never crying out loud. None of it. Did I do it? Did I overload the beta core? Where's the save point? Ha! Ah. Ha. Ah. Hostiles nearby. Loco, rocks literally have an IQ of zero. True, but like, rocks have also been around for like, you know, millions of years. Many of them have been traveling through space and shit for a long time, or, you know, and we're all just gonna be dead soon. At least in rock terms. They have seen some shit, if they had eyes. If they had eyes, they would have seen some shit.
Looks like there's a party outside. Those are just the disco lights. We're right outside of the club right now. Do you think we're going to be able to get in? Got to warm up a little bit. Got to practice our dance moves. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. All right, return to the central reactor. Well, this is gonna be easy. <clears throat> Lucky did you win? Yes, I've been winning all the time. Loco, you call those dance moves? Yes, this is the classic Loco dance move. Another popular loco in the club dance move is the grabbing the stars. Where you just pretend that they're stars and you grab those. But those moves are only brought out when... Uh, slightly more intoxicated than I should be. <laughs> just, yeah, exactly. Just look at what other people are doing and then just try and copy that poorly. Who's a better dancer? Loco or Commander Shepard? It's about the same, really. Yeah. Like, I was roasting Commander Shepard's uh, dancing skills in Mass Effect. But honestly, it's not like I could do a better job. Wow, wow. <laughs> it honestly does feel nicer. <laughs> when I see Twitch chat going wow every time, for a split second I'm like, ooh, someone thought I did something good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, see? It's, uh, yeah. It's reverse psychology, it works. <sighs> wow. You can really dance. Wow. You can really dance. I go. What a coincidence. Loco, I can't believe you did that all on the first try. Right? And I didn't scream a single time. Watch this. Stop being scared. Look. Watch this. Come here, dang you little bitch. Huh? Easy. Wow. You can really dance. Wow. You can really dance. Oh, man. No, I'm not really a dancer. No. Ricardo, I can destroy the nest. No, you can't! Ripley! Ripley, shut up! I can power up all the cores, overload them, and then initiate a reactor purge. It'll destroy everything down there. Look, I'm not trying to persuade you out of this, Rip. I'd just like it if you didn't die. Alternative, uh, alternative option? What about we just all get off of the platform and let these aliens and androids figure it out on their own? This Sephestopol ship is done for anyway. Just leave. Get out of here. It's much easier. We don't have to kill them all. Just don't come back. This is what's going to happen. There are emergency overflow circuits that feed excess power into the local capacitor banks on each tower. If I Nerd. can them and discharge the system, the purge will be external. The nest is right in harm's way. I have no clue what you just said. Nerd. Just find something to hold on to. Leave now and never come back. Ricardo is useless, 100%. Do I have to kill these guys again? Why is it raining inside of a spaceship? Rain is nice. Oh, 
Who's next? You? You! Donations. Woo. Ripley behaving like her insurance company is going to pay out if she dies. That's uh, a very uh, American donation message. Thank you, Shake. <laughs> What? This guy! I didn't miss, did I? more help in those rubber suits? Or did they shuffle? Do you think they shuffled? You know what? I feel like this is Molotov behavior now. Catch! Hey! What the? How? How are you? I should do a little bit of looting though around here. No, aliens don't know how to ride elevators, Chet. Everyone knows this. They have no clue how to do elevators. So we're good as far as that goes. Thank you, by the way, Marina, for the 47 month resub during uh, my little dance with the, uh, the bad guys. is the oh this doesn't look very safe no this whole place looks kind of kind of rough the beta core is over here what why does it show two objectives which one did I do I thought I did the alpha one Am I dumb? Don't answer that. Hey, I found it. First try. Wow.
Was there another sex W on the screen? Was there really? Wow, dude. Games like interact with all the things. Just do everything. What is this then? What the? F ah. We've only had that thing like once or twice. Whoa, lads, where'd you come from? Ah! Sorry, being a little dramatic. Oh. Number two. How? I don't understand this game. No, they don't. They're wearing rubber boots now, Chet. I can't use EMPs. Rubber boots OP confirmed. Bro, I don't understand. That was straight through his face. That was completely off, Loco. No, it wasn't. It was perfect. All my shots are flawless. I never miss. No, genuinely, I don't think these were missed. But maybe, I don't know. Alright, it's a bit too intense, man. Can I... Party's really getting started now, man, judging by the lights. Yeah, there we go. Here it comes. No, no, I'm here for the party, dude. What do you guys mean, run? It's a spectacle. Like, you can't just run right before the climax. Oh, I gotta go to the other side again. Hold up. When will the base drop? When will the base drop? I can hear the bass coming. When will the bass drop? When will the bass... It's coming! When will the bass drop? When will the bass drop? It's gonna be here any second now. Oh my god. I hate it when the DJ does that, dude. When the DJ's like, oh, 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 and everyone's like, fuck me, dude. Get it going. <sighs> All right, fine. I'll just leave now. No bass drop, Chip. No, no climax. Do I have to climb into that vent? I got drop blocked. No climax. Yeah. <sighs> 
Oh shit, dude. We got to see the operation chamber over here. Hell yeah. What are we doing? I have no idea. Birch! Birch! I'm about to perch the nest. Hang tight. Push the buttons! Interact with the things! Left! Yeah, let's pretend that we know what that means. We should duck. We really shouldn't be here. This is how you get glass in your face. As a rock, baby! Never scared! Power levels throughout Sebastopol compromised. There's still some on the station. Shit. Huh. I'm... I'm sorry, Ricardo. Just step back to the Marshall Bureau, Rip. No! Mate! Are we almost done? I feel like the game has been like... I feel like I've been at 99.9% .9 of the game for hours. But... I feel like there's still like more. Dinner's ready, boys. I gotta go. The game is edging me all the time. Okay, hold up. All right, I told her that the game was edging me the entire Wait, time. Rip, something weird's happening. Oh yeah, of course. You think? I need you to get to medical. Now. The reactor purge. It's resetting systems across Sevastopol. Lights, transit, maybe even communications. I think this is our big chance. Just go. Now. We might not have much time. I'm heading down to comms. Just give me a safe, bro. I need like a beep beep. Is there another two hours to this game? Wait, for real? Beep. Beep. Another two to three hours? Okay, well then we'll finish it on Monday. This game has been teasing me for hours. I feel like we are so close to the end. <laughs> All right, I'll finish it on Monday. Alrighty, guys. Welcome back to this wonderful game called Alien Isolation. Ha, oh, loving this game, huge fan. Sadly, Okay, now all jokes aside, it's actually been really good. I've been really enjoying this. Even though I'm not really a big fan of horror games at all. Um, we are gonna wrap up this game today. I don't really know exactly how much is remaining. So last Saturday, it felt like I was like just about to get to the credits. And maybe I am. So Thort said, Loco, the game is ending in like five minutes. I was like, oh, okay, we'll keep playing. And then someone else in the chat said, Loco, the game is ending in like two hours. So I was like, oh, I guess I'll stop. Uh, so this is where we are. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna be anywhere between five minutes and two hours is what I uh, is what I'm expecting right now But basically the entire station is screwed. It turns out there's uh, a lot of these Aliens crawling around this place right now We found out that even though we yeeted one into a gas giant and that one is super dead turns out there's a nest of them We tried blowing up the nest successfully did so but a whole bunch managed to escape anyway so currently, uh, we gotta go to San Cristobal Medical Facility, which is where we are at right now. I don't really know exactly, uh... Service offline. I don't even really know exactly where we're supposed to go. Transit service deficient. Please 
fill out one of the forms provided. I don't want to fill out any of the forms provided. Which one am I supposed to go? Do I just activate them all? So restore power? Okay, it seems like I can only activate one of them, so... <sighs> Loco, last time I was here, you had launched the alien out of the airlock? Yeah, yeah, it went great. We did launch the alien out of the airlock. We only found out that it turns out there's an entire nest of them. <sighs> so, I don't know what the ending of this game is gonna be like. I haven't seen the movies, again, so please don't spoil anything for me. Yeah, I have pissed them off properly. They deployed this new type of alien as well. And um, this new type of alien was a little bit scary. Someone left a duffel bag, by the way, in the tram. I mean, I don't know if I'm just conditioned this way right now, but that's definitely a bomb. Oh my god. Get out of here! Don't sit next to the bag at the very least. People don't leave duffel bags like that. Like, fully. Like, there are, what, no way, man. Yeah, they got face huggers and everything. This is that awkward moment. Like, you're in an elevator and you're like, okay, I don't know which side is gonna open. Is it gonna open behind me or in front of me? The um. Okay, we are going the right way. That's good. Face huggers are little babies. They're, they're they're not very nice, man. They made me scream a couple of times. But in a very manly way, though. In a very manly way. <clears throat> Testosterone was practically pouring out of my monitor when I screamed. That's <clears throat> right. Mm, not 100% true. I scream to intimidate the aliens. Right. Yes. The thing... Yeah, yeah, yeah. They, they were not tears. They were... Liquid testosterone. I'm also not definitely standing around here. In a scared way whatsoever. Um, okay. We're almost there. No duffel bag this time around, so we're good. <sighs> oh, there were there were a couple of jump scares last Saturday, yeah. Honestly, the nest is probably the scariest part of this game. I hope it's not gonna get worse. I don't know. The nest really was kind of scary. I'm sure someone could pull up a clip. Did you manage to get to comms? I'm here. Apollo's recovered from the reactor purge and knocked out external comms again. Damn it. So why'd you send me here? Plan B, Rip. See, before I left, the system showed a ship approaching Sevastopol. I think it's the Anisadora. Marlow managed to send out his auto codes to call it in while comms were temporarily open. We've got to get to it. Is it docking? No, but it's in a holding position nearby. Head for the ambulance bay. The shuttle's in really short range, but they'll make it. Go. Oh, man. Okay, I'm gonna save first, and then... Oh, yeah, we are currently in a space station, but it's like... It's a space station that is uh, essentially one ginormous airport. Think of it as a space station that's... Uh... It's like the Detroit airport, but then... Uh... You know, in space. You're basically inside the whole time. I don't know why I think of the Detroit airport. I went to the Detroit airport once and it felt massive. Maybe I'm crazy. Maybe I was stressed out. I don't know. It's a big one though, right? Schiphol, Schiphol in Amsterdam is nice. I like Schiphol. 
Maybe that's once again me being biased, but I like Schiphol quite a bit. It's a nice airport. Looters New will subscriber pay. Detected. Fantastic. What's going on, Babin? Pros of employment, worry-free sub. Cons of employment, no time to watch. Hope Oof. you're doing good, Logo. I am doing great, Babin. Thank you very much for your subscription. Hope your job at the very least has been fun. The Atlanta one is huge. <sighs> what state is Atlanta in again? I'm thinking of it. I see a from my terminal. New subscriber detected. Oh god. It's in Georgia? Oh, okay. Yeah, the US has a bunch of really big airports, I guess. Oh, here's a clip. Okay, let's see. What is this clip? <laughs> Fuck these things! <laughs> I told you, very manly. Especially the hand motion. The hand motion was something. <laughs> Fuck these! <laughs> what the f What was that, Loco, from the past? Oh, we're back here again? Oh, jeez. Dude. Oh. There's no way this game is gonna have a happy ending. I don't believe it. I mean, to be fair, these movies were made a couple decades ago, right? So maybe they didn't really make bad endings yet? Two movies? So maybe, you know, like... I don't know. I'm not sure, dude. <sighs> I've only ever walked around this place with the alien, like this exact location. Yeah, I remember you. <gasps> oh, it's just an android, guys. I don't know if I mean bolt guns in it or bolt. Okay. Hey, what about this festival safety protocols? Ow, 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 ow. It's a joke, it's a joke, it's a joke, it's a joke. Yes, there is. Guys. It's my two best friends right next to each other. That's nice. I see a from my terminal. My Donation confirmed. <sighs> That's just great. Thank you, probably Bradley. Who would win in StarCraft 2? You or Winter? Does Winter even play StarCraft 2? Do I even play StarCraft 2? If neither of us uh, plays StarCraft 2, like how? You both quit, Loco? Oh, okay. But I've got a StarCraft 2 video going up tonight. You wanna see? This is today's YouTube video. Anyone here cool enough to recognize this map just from this location? From this one spot? The screen is tilted 90 degrees. Anyone know? It's an old map. It's a very old map. Anyone have any ideas? I casted uh, a couple of games from a Wings of Liberty tournament that was held last Saturday. So this was like a $1,000 Wings of Liberty tournament. Um... Which was obviously different than the regular games. This particular map with this particular siege tank drop-off spot 
is Antigua Shipyard. <laughs> it's probably a map you haven't heard of in about a decade. For good reason, because the map is ass. The map's so bad. I also casted two Protoss versus Protoss games. On Steps of War. Video's going up tonight. Talking about the alien? Steps of War is a tiny one, yes. It's actually a very fun set of games. I don't know if the alien and the robot interact. Loco the game is very happy. You and the Xenomorph will have a very beautiful family in your wedding. There will be all friends, the robots, the little handy hands, and all your other friends at the end. What? Okay. We will see Xeno Jr. Is that a baby? With the Xenomorph? Aw. So I can't really kill Alien, bro. Oh, they're right next to each other. That's just wonderful. Um... Yeah, that's not the right way to go. I have to... <laughs> I could go over there, but that's not the right way. Oh, jeez. How am I going to avoid two of them? I need to cross. Okay, good. I cannot like I if I sh if I fire my shotgun the alien will come. I can kill I can kill the the android but not the alien. I oh, wait, I can use the flamethrower obviously, right? Yeah, yeah. I should definitely do that. Sorry, I forgot about the flamethrower for a second. I could gun down the android and then shoot the flamethrower at the alien. Yeah, this is the strat. It's a good build order, chat. First shotgun. Secondly, flamethrower. It's a proper... Face tank strategy. Don't run. What? Okay, okay, okay. Still alive. Be scared, chat. I 
I have a good amount of ammo. I think it's fine. Okay. Lean back! <gasps> oh, I'd be so dead, dude. If I was ever in this kind of apocalypse situation, I'd be so screwed. I'd be the first one to die. I'd be coughing right now or something. Loco is about to squeal like it's Fox News. No idea what that means. But yeah, let's make it political, bro. That seems like a good idea. That seems like a... Back off! Mate, I can't do that too often though, because I don't have that much. Just be scared. Just back off right now. There you go. How much more? Okay, we're almost there. Guys, what am I walking into right now? Oh my god, that cost me half of the amount I have. <sighs> Find an ambulance craft? Why am I supposed to find an ambulance craft game? He doesn't seem to be too scared anymore of flamethrowers. I noticed that. Damn, my access tuner isn't powerful enough. Bro! There is no way, bro. Find a level three upgrade? Where? Mate, I think I have to go all the way back to the area I was just at. And find an upgrade. It's probably somewhere... Here. Anywhere. In any of those... I don't know, 20 or so rooms. It could be over here. <gasps> it's over here? Oh my god! Didn't expect that to be honest. The game actually being convenient for once? I don't know, man. It's probably got some sort of trick up its sleeve soon enough. Oh, geez, that's a lot of things. Oof. The game's never been this convenient. Coordinates already in the system. Just punch the dash. What about you? Fuck you, Ricardo. I don't care. Let's go. I, I'm just, it was a joke, Ricardo. But I, I get to be selfish after like 15 plus hours of me trying to not die. Saving others. Everyone died anyway. Let's hope I don't need those flamethrower things. Oh! There we go. This thing launches sideways? Not what I expected, but... Did we just make it out? No one can hear you scream in space. True. Did, no. Why did we dock somewhere? Ricardo, can you hear me? 
Are we, are we at that other ship? Did we dock on the second ship that apparently was detected? Is that what we did? Yeah, 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 the Anisadora. Okay. The objective is right now to explore the Anisadora. Um, I'll be honest with you, Anisadora doesn't look so hot anymore. Aw, oh, man, this is gonna be great. Bring the Anisadora systems back online. All right. Luckily, I'm an engineer. I'll show you guys how to do it, okay? So basically, first you connect the thing with the thing, and then you press the button on the thing, and then once the thing is powered up again, we're good to go. Isn't this the ship that we initially arrived on is this the original ship that we like no no no. okay okay this is mar okay okay oh this is marlo's ship okay 